Hi, everybody. Hi. It's Kid Wiggle. Today is April the 19th, and it's the uh, 53rd day of insanity, which means I have uh, 10 days left. Uh, <laughs> I have to apologize now. Um, I just having a hard time putting up these videos, so... You know, I thought today I'd post real early just so I could have it done with and out of the way. And then uh, this is the third time. I don't know what the problem is. Um, today was, was recovery day. Um, and quickly becoming one of my favorite workouts. Uh, for my P90X people, I can kind of, you could kind of say it's kind of like a core synergistics or insanity's version of it. No, I can't. Um, where you, you're using your whole body. And, and just because it's recovery doesn't mean it can't be hard. If you're working during the plank sections and the plie squats, you're working hard. Um... I've been thinking more and more about what I'm going to do next with uh, 10 days out. And I think the what's sounding really nice is doing some outside workout stuff. Because I've spent the last... Are you going to be quiet? Okay. Thank you. Uh, so, you know, I've spent more than a year working out inside uh, aside from Easter and like two or three times that I ran in September of last year I think was the Susan B. Coleman race for the cure I did train a little outside but it would be nice to take what I do kind of outside in the sun and the fresh air <sighs> just to mix it up just to do something different uh, I've been uh, you know between all the various workouts that I've looked at like full body stuff where you're doing full body go at, at low rest and there's no reason you can't do all of that outside uh, utilizing tools like Bulgarian bag um, heavy stuff ropes. Uh, so that sounds kind of cool. I will, for a fact, be buying heavier weights this summer. I, you know, I've kind of been saving money up to buy the Bowflex Selectex or something similar to that. I just, uh, it's hard for me to make that kind of financial commitment. I don't know why. I mean, I'm not going to stop working out. And yeah, it's a, it's a fair amount of money, but I wouldn't have to buy weights again, right? I don't know. It's something I'll have to think about. Uh, definitely can't just go make a purchase that big without talking to my wife about it. Plus, they'll be around. And that's always going to be... Uh, I know some of you guys have kids. I don't know if all of you guys have kids. But, like, you know, kids break shit. And my kids do for sure. Uh, they don't... So, I mean, I'd love to have them. Believe me. Uh, when I first saw them, I was like, oh, those are really cool. When I first, like, handled them, I was like, those are way way cool and you know it's easy to say that that's I mean you wouldn't have to buy another set it, it takes up way less space than a rack I have my weights five I have five dumbbells total on the, like the bottom of a shoe rack to keep them out of the way and uh, I mean, we're talking about if I buy another set of weights, 
Um, you know, I, I pretty much own the 25s on just about everything. But I wouldn't want to just grab, you know, I couldn't grab 40s and do that, I don't think. And then I'd be afraid if I grabbed anywhere, you know, 30s would, I'd be done with those fairly quickly. I don't know. <laughs> I'm going to have to uh, do some warm up and then go to a sporting goods store and just start fondling the weights. I, I wonder if anyone's ever done that. Just went in there and just got a whole set on. What if I take my, uh, take my workbook to dick sporting goods and just, uh, just have a workout? I wonder if that would be frowned upon. To be honest, I don't, if I worked at a shop like that and some dude came in to get their swole on, I'd just leave them alone. Give them a spot. <laughs> uh, I hope this video goes up. I'm so tired of talking. Uh, I, honestly, I said cool stuff on my first video about working out and being focused and this being the last 10 days, so let's see what I can get. And then the second video... I said that stuff, kind of, and then on the third video, is this third? I think this one's third. Uh, yeah, I don't, um, it sucks for you guys, because uh, you miss some of that good stuff, and then I'm fr frustrated with it. So, uh, here's to, here's to getting up the video. Kid Wiggle, uh, with the five, one, the three. It's gorgeous outside. It is so nice.